You're looking at a South Bend Heavy 10 by 24. This machine is not perfect and nor is this video because it's a little bit dark. Sorry about that, but our lights, um, we've had a problem with the lights here. Overall, Dan, why don't you get the D light so we can shine a little light on the subject. Might be in the back seat of the truck. But this machine's in pretty nice shape. It does have, the handle has been changed out, as you can tell, and the door's a little sticky where it opens up. It does open up, but it's a little sticky. It also is on caster wheels, which is a little strange. This machine is, as I said, is a 10 by 24. And it does have the large opening in the back. So if you're going to use 5C collets, that's fine. This machine will be the one. It also has a notch out. It's a piece of broken cast in the uh, compound slide. But this one does come with the taper attachment, which is kind of sought after. Comes with a three-jaw chuck. I don't know if there's a chuck key in the drawer or not. This machine is wired for three phase. And it is 440 right now, but it can be changed to 220. Dan's going to go ahead and fire this machine up for you so you can see it running. It actually doesn't sound too bad, but it's not perfect in all ranges. It gets a little noisy and um, when you go real fast. Dan does have the, comp or the cross slide feeding right now. He's going to turn that off. And he's going to put it on, put it all the way up. Oh and feed it again. The belt definitely needs tightened. I should have told you that before. I could tell it was a little loose when we first started it up. When you start to feed up, you can see it kind of, feel it kind of bogged down a little bit. Okay, now he's gonna put it on for threading. If you notice also, this does have the large dial on the cross feed, but not on the compound. And he's going to pull the lever up. No, nope, he's going to turn the feedback off. And then the lever up. So... No, what are you doing? As you can tell, he pulled the, that up for threading. This will be in a faster range for threading. Most of you guys probably know that. It does come with the thread dial also. Comes with the obviously the tail stock and this cabinet does have the three drawers in it this is i guess what would be commonly referred to as the old 10 the old heavy 10. again we thank you for your business this machine will need a little bit of work but overall it's in excellent shape thank you and have a blessed day